court, the Lafayette County Courthouse on the square has been the center of Oxford's social life since the city was started. In 1840, the actual Lafayette County Courthouse was built and then burnt down in 1864 by Union troops during the Civil War. The building is, has become a national monument and was actually named a national monument in 1977 for people all around the nation to come and visit the beautiful Oxford, Mississippi. As one of the national monuments, many people come here to visit, to do artwork on the building, to just explore inside of the building and learn about the city's culture. Inside of the building, there is actually a court that takes place still. So every once in a while on the square, you'll see criminals come in and out of the courthouse, but it's also still a national monument to all of us in Oxford. The first thing you see as you enter the Ole Miss campus in Oxford, Mississippi, is this statue of a Confederate soldier right behind me. The Confederate soldier statue is placed right in the center of the square, right in front of this grand building behind me called the Lyceum. Occupying the same position in the circle since 1906, this statue has become a huge monument for the University of Mississippi. The statue is shaped as if it's a pillar and it has almost a castle-like inscription on the bottom with a soldier that's facing and, and looking off into the distance with a rifle by his side. The inscription that is on the actual statue is to our Confederate dead, 1861 to 1865, Albert Sidney Johnson, chapter 379. With the outbreak of the Civil War in 1861, Classes were basically let go, and both students and faculty went to go and apply to be in the Confederate Army. This place is a great spot for people that come to visit Mississippi to come look at, as well as visitors who come and tailgate in the Grove, come also spill over into the circle and tailgate around this Confederate soldier monument. 